What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about flight attendant life hacks. So I've been a flight attendant for about a year and a half now. I got hired in September. So I'm going to tell you about the secrets that I like to keep with my stuff. So let's just get to it. All right, so our first hack is going to be my newest gift that I've gotten recently. Um, my first hack is going to be bring something to entertain you on the plane. Now, it doesn't have to be what I'm about to show you, but it this will help if you are a book nut like me. But I like to bring a book or my DS or my Kindle with me whenever I am on the airplane because it gives me something that I can sit there and read and it doesn't look like I'm sitting there on my phone. That is awesome. I also like it because when I'm going to go on deadheads, which is when I'm working but I'm a passenger, I can actually sit there and read. I put in my headphones and then I don't have to talk to passengers. I can just sit there and be reading my book. <laughs> the next flight attendant hack is going to be my planner. I am in college right now, so I fly and I am online in school. Everything that I need to know, I write out and then I highlight in the boxes the day off that I need. So if I see this one, I needed the day off for my persuasive speech for college and I need that day off because I won't be in the state for it. So I need to make sure that I'm in the state. Um, so this thing is awesome. You can like see it on paper it makes me feel a little bit more comfortable. I mean, my my phone does very well and everything, but I also write it in that big calendar and my phone doesn't really show the big calendar. So I really like that part. That part's pretty awesome. My next flight attendant hack would be my flashlight. This is the flashlight I keep on my lanyard for work. This is a flashlight I got in Traverse City and you can pull it apart and the light turns on. Push it back in and the light turns off. That's easy peasy. Saves its battery and you have it for all times. All you gotta do is and it's on. So I love this thing. The next flight attendant hack, I'm going through my lanyard. Uh, flight attendant hack I like to keep in my flight attendant lanyard is a temperature thing. This shows you exactly what temperature from Fahrenheit and Celsius. So today I was on a Montreal flight and I was talking to two men that have been living in Canada for their entire life. So I was like, oh yeah, it's uh, they're going to Orlando and I was like, yeah, I heard that it's like 70 degrees there recently and they're like, what? And I was like, oh, hold on, let me check. It's 21 degrees there and they're like, oh my gosh, that's so warm. And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Another flight attendant hack that I have is my, it is my can opener. It's a ring that fits right here. I got it in one of the flight attendant stores, but literally you have your tab and it goes right underneath the tab and it pulls it right up and you don't have to mess up your nails or anything even though my nails aren't painted at all but you don't have to worry about messing up your nails and it's super sweet my main flight attendant life hack is my crew cooler this is my manual bag slash lunchbox it holds everything that I have to have for work and it has all of my food. Alright, the first hack that I have to do for this bag is definitely the cooler section. Okay, so you always bring food that you can make in the airplane. So I have all kinds of oatmeal in here and I have sweet uh, peach tea that I can throw in my water bottles. I have cookies and hot chocolate. I also have popcorn in there because I love popcorn. But I have learned in the past year or so that as a flight attendant, I never get off the airplane. I am hardly off the airplane. I can sit on the airplane for about 12 hours. But for some reason, I always end up getting stuck on the airplane. 
So, I always have something that I can tie myself over so I don't start being a cranky flight attendant. Continuing with the tour of this bag real quick. This bag is super awesome. You, okay, so the cooler you saw, the top, I keep, I keep my manual for work, my Kindle, my planner, my DS, Bluetooth headphones, my portable charger, my retainer, some floss, and all of my chargers all up here. On this side, I keep all kinds of pens, full of pens, because when you go to Canada or you go out of the country, you need somebody, or everybody's going to ask you for a pen, and I like to collect pens from the hotels and stuff, the ones that I wouldn't care if they lost. See, I'm very picky with my pens. I like to keep a pen that has a click and has a thing on it. So I, uh, I don't usually give out my own pens, but I give out the hotel pens for sure. And on this side, I have my little first aid kit and more flashlights. This is, this is, if you're in initial training for being a flight attendant, this is a big flashlight for your lanyard. Okay. So this is my lanyard and this is the flashlight that is huge. Look at the difference between my flashlight that I carry around with me all the time and this flashlight. That is a good inch. And this is a lot heavier than this one. But it's very light. Just in case, you always need a flashlight, you know. So I have, I carry three flashlights with me at all times. So that is what's in that section. These pockets on the side are also very great because they unzip all the way. So you can actually open it all the way up and get, put like a water bottle in there or something. But I don't do that. Last but not least, there's still more. Oof. There is a front pocket. And this is the pocket that I put my section counts in, my announcement book in, and then... I put my apron in here too, and then I keep my passport in there, because my passport is always in the front pocket, it's always in the same pocket, it will never leave, and then I have some little wings for little kids if I end up running into any little kids that seem cool enough to be honorary crew members, you know. Yeah. Thanks for watching! If you like this channel, please subscribe! Uh, leave a comment down below if you have any flight attendant life hacks that you think I should have added. And I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. So my beauty hack is... I was just watching a video on beauty hacks. Shut up. Stop saying beauty hack. Okay. My next flight attendant hack would be my flashlight. This flashlight I got in Traverse City in one of those random stores, but this is a really nice flashlight. It's LED and it it's pretty great. It's a very strong magnet, so that's helpful. Ooh, I don't want to show you my ID. So I'm going to redo that completely so I can possibly get keep my ID off. Okay, another flight attendant hack. So this incorporates with it. For my, my first hack, <laughs> is always bring food. My, 